that's going to be a game changer. Even a box, it looks great. It has a magnet in the box, perfect in every detail. That's gonna be another level in my production. It's gonna change my workflow completely. I'm so happy, for real. So well made, doesn't weigh anything. Finally, I don't have to use any carton boards. I didn't need it anymore. Perfect filter system, slots, a wheel. You could detach the hood. Thread it late. It feels so solid. This is really well made. I have to say congratulations for Polar Pro. Clubs for different sizes. As for me, I'm okay with 77 and 82 mils that they got in the set. Maybe in the future I will have more lenses. I think it's gonna be a time saver. The bag is amazing. I don't have to worry about the storage anymore. This is where the fun starts. Variable ND629. Seven to seven mils and a circular polarizer. This is pure magic. They can change the light completely. It's definitely high quality. It's different from this one that I had before. Two to five. It's nice weather outside. I want to go out and record something. After a whole day spent with Basecamp, I can easily infer that it is the best easy-made matbox available on the market right now. It is perfect for both advanced and beginner users as it's fabulously easy to use. The filter system is brilliant, the case is reliable in every detail, and the glass itself is high quality. This is a big alternative for heavy and complicated systems available on the web. As for me, who used to use a regular and the filters. This is a game changer because now my workload has astonishingly improved. Previously, I had to arrive at the set, check the light available, and decide which one to put on the lens. And after a long day of shooting, the differences between the NDs I was using were uncomfortably noticeable in editing. Combination of the base comp and a good monitor like Atomos Ninja Assassin that I use allows you to feel a full power over the light.
Lack of hard stops like in most of VNDs lets you adjust exposure in non-rational units. It is like analog sound on the vinyl record. It's lightweight, as the producer quotes it's only 289 grams which places it on the top on the list in its class. It would suggest it's poorly made, but even in this term it has truly surprised me. Everything fits tight and feels firm. The hood itself has a hollow frame which reduces the drag. I haven't tried it on gimbal yet, but I will and I am gonna give you the results in the next video. The flag is multifunctional. It is not only blocking unwanted light which causes flares and strays, but it also protects the filter when it's transported. You can always detach the flag and even the whole hood thanks to snap-on wings on the side. Talking about carrying, the bag included in the set is just the right size and thanks to attachment options on the side, you can easily mount it on your backpack and don't even feel that it is there. With 2 to 5 and 6 to 9 filters you can control the light completely without necessity to change a filter. The only weakness I found so far is the wheel on the top. It is a little bit small but I can live with it. I'm just worried how it's gonna be in the winter. It's nothing what you turn like wheel in the car, just for adjustments. The filters are built in in a thin metal frame with a neat handle on top which prevents fingerprints and changing them is super easy. The glass itself appears to be very different from this I was using before. The dust doesn't stick so easily and the cleaning doesn't leave trails. Color is uniform across the whole frame with exception when you come down to the very bottom of polarization with CP. For more drastic changes you have the option of changing the filter for darker. The usable range is plain. Ferdo plates are stiff and lightweight, twisting them on is utterly effortless. First I was worried that it would untwist itself, but it holds the position quite well. The options for 77 and 82 mils are perfect for me and most of you, because these are the most widely used threads on lenses in popular DSLRs. In the box, Polar Pro included plastic clamps for other sizes and the core itself will fit up to 114 mm of outer diameter lenses. On their website you can find more options and configurations, as well as more detailed specs about their products. It is worth checking them out, as they have a wide range offer. Overall, this is a great ratio of value to what you get. When you start using it, you realize this is a giant time saver, because you don't need any tools and it is well thought out. This is just amazing, Polar Pro, this is a great job. Basecamp, this is definitely something what I can recommend to everyone who wants to record outside and is thinking about buying some ND filters. ND filters are important and you have to be aware of that, that if you have to invest something and you're gonna spend like a couple hundred dollars, spend it wisely, spend it right. You're gonna like it. I'll provide you more footage and enjoy.